Okay, welcome to an Elden Ring story part one. <laughs> Jesus Christ, bananas. So, this is like fucking... So, first and foremost, this is my second favorite video game of all time. First being GoldenEye, of course. But is this a GoldenEye story? No, it's an Elden Ring story. Part one. Now, it's taken me... I don't know, nine... Nine and a half months to finish the main story, so to, f to defeat Radagon, and now I've just defeated Melania. Taking me 11 months, so I've defeated all the bosses. Anyway, spoiler alert: <laughs> this is really a story of my experience in this game. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Now, it's not going to be a tutorial. <sighs> People have done that. This is my experience. So f what I want to focus on here is the AI. The AI is fantastic. Just check out the AI. <laughs> I guess what they're doing. I think, I think it's fantastic to watch. I I any enemies in this is great. And there's been so many instances where um, I've been watching this back and I've, I've only noticed that the enemies can deal... I don't know if they can deal critical attacks like against in uh, like other enemies but uh, I've heard the claim that they're about to do this so check this out so this next move I think it's the next move one of the next moves this next move here so it's it's like it it hit it but didn't didn't do what it was supposed to I don't know either way I found that segment very fucking uh, uh, interesting when I watched when I played it back uh, so yeah look <sighs> This is an, this is a story of my experience in this game. This lands between fucking wherever the fuck you come from. Oh, funny, I had a corpse. There's a lot of corpses there. So I'm going to be going. Oh, it's it's not it's not it's in order of um, it's in order of all of the uh, captures that uh, that I did. The uh, what do you call it with the capture gallery? So I. Uh, I captured the footage, I guess it was. So this is the first ever, ever it's not really the first ever day. So, the thing is as well, you, by this stage I've already defeated uh, um, Margaret, as he was first known before he was like, fuck it, I'm Morgoth. You know, that's my real name. So there, there was a, quite a lot I did, but for some reason I must have deleted the capture files, I don't know. but. I also want to laugh at myself for how ridiculous I am at this game. Uh, <laughs> it's just, a, I'm astonishingly shit, right? Astonishingly shit. So, <laughs> and I say that because, you know, you, you, you saw it. Sure, I finished this game, as I said, I'm going to state it for a million years because bragging rights, right? But, You'll see at the start of this, I have zero awareness of how to to attack, how to block, how to even play this fucking game. So I'm gonna run past this guy. You know what? Thinking about it, I don't think I've killed that guy before. I think he's still there, chilling out to kill all the other invaders. Um, right. So, yeah. So I'm gonna laugh at myself. Look, okay, this is the first instance of, of bringing up my fucking torch. <sighs> Obviously, I finished this, so so I've done it. That doesn't mean I'm any good. <laughs> it just means that I've done it. Look at me fucking rolling here, right? So this, I really cut down these little segment thingies. Again, this is part one. Who knows how many fucking parts they're going to be? But it's my experience, my experience through this thing, right? So I hate those little fucking imp things that give me the shit. Oh, so I get to here, I'm like, oh, I've already done this dungeon, yay, what a waste of fucking time. So again, I've, I've done so much in this, well, not so much, I've done quite a lot in this game. There's a fucking crab. The crab shoots water for some reason. Now, I can't remember if that, like, hurts you. And I'm going to be, I'm going to be discussing a lot of the different weapons and items. I don't know what they're fucking called. There's, there's something. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, man. This fucking guy, right? Hmm, yeah, let's attack him from behind. So, okay, so give you background of, of me, of my experience in the Soul series. I've played all the Soul series. I've only ever finished Dark Souls 3 three times. 
bragging rights, right? The first time took nine months. The second took four days for some fucking reason. The third time took another nine months. Now, again, this game took me about nine months to uh, finish the main story. About 11 months to finish all of the bosses. All the main big boss. Melania was the last. She was an absolute bitch. Um, and I did that video of that. Put that up the other day. Oh, I've got coffee here, so excuse my sipping. But anyways, so we got this big fucking bird. I was trying to hide from him, right? I had no what he was. I don't. I had no idea what he was going to do. I had no idea. Um. <laughs> you know what? I, you know what I wanted him to do. I know what I wanted him to do. I wanted him to jump off the fucking edge. Um, and see how he was kind of glitching a bit? That's cool. The amount, the amount of times I've seen uh, enemies in this game glitch out, or they'll either fall off, or they'll disappear entirely, or whatever. So... Now, okay, so as far as builds go... Uh, samurai, and I've got Dex, because that's what they said was really good. And, and you know, I came straight from playing... I was going to say Serenity. Fucking Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice. Uh, so... I loved the samurai aesthetics. Here we go. Bow, bow. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking whoops. <laughs> uh, right. Say big bird. And now round two. I'm like, oh, fuck it. I'll just run past him. Right? So again, this... I know a bit about this. <laughs> I finished it. I've done it. The... the the only two bosses that I needed actual like, help with was um, fucking Mo, the Lord of Blood. And, oh man, he, <laughs> and he killed me again. It's fucking bird. My live stream killing Mo was fucking embarrassing, man. It was hilarious. It took me like an hour to figure out how to fuck to summon someone. And then when they did, they they they. I don't think I even hit Mo. He he annihilated him straight away. And then so that was yeah the first and only boss that. Um, that someone look at this map it's embarrassing I've got nothing open um, but my brother helped uh, he, he destroyed some black knight prick in um, uh, fucking Atlas plateau he was guarding some tomb it was just a bitch of a boss so this is castle morn so <laughs> check this shit out again I, I was very look I, I come from Dark Souls 3 finishing it three times so I was I was quite aware how the Soul series worked. I was I didn't come in total blind, like fucking right, but I was I was still naive to it. Oh no, fuck! Right, so I was aware of it enough, but I still wasn't disciplined to read everything. And uh, I've gone to the shield now. I'm not using that fucking torch, but I'm still, you know, I'm still using. I'm not even using double fucking double fucking hands on your weapon yet. Oh, and I could have gone back and done the side of grace. I did later, of course. <laughs> Check this shit out. Uh, boom. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> I don't know the fucking characters. A lot of the char I know a lot of the characters' names. Uh, the weapons, I don't. The items... Again, look, I finished it. I don't know much, but I know enough. I know what works. Now, I wanted to show you this fucking boss, because this is embarrassing, but fucking hilarious. Again, the majority of my, my, my plays are embarrassing because of how fucking shit I am at this. And I'll, look, I'll, I'll take the pitch to challenge, man. I'll, I will shit on this more than you, you can fucking shit on this. You try and shit on this, you won't shit on this more than I will shit on this. Right? I'll fucking diarrhea on this shit. On myself. <laughs> anyway, that boss, that fucking um, lion with a fucking lizard tail, he's pretty terrifying. Like, I, I got pretty scared of him when I first encountered him. Uh, and look at me go. I'd be the worst leader. I'd be... I'm letting my fucking soldiers, you know, die, and I'm not, I'm not doing anything. I, I'm only hoping that Either glitches out, or s something happens where uh, the summoners do some mighty move and destroy him, so I don't have to do anything, and I can just get past him. I, I am quite impatient when it comes. I was quite impatient when it comes to these games. 
but clearly my patience has grown <laughs> because I've finished it. You know, fucking millennia, it took me like 50 million fucking times. Right? So clearly my patience level was enough. Uh, to, and I'm like, oh, cool, I'll hide behind this castle then. No worries, no worries. Oh, I'll fucking crouch there as well. Yeah, easy. Can't get me here. Oh, what? Where'd that come from? Oh, I can't fucking hide, eh? Oh, the fucking lion thing. Jesus, fucking Aslan from the Chronicles of fucking Narnia. Oh, no, it's got me again. Oh, can I get away? Can I get away? No, I can't. It's fucked me. Right? It's glowing fucking eyes. Oh, man. Yeah, I died. I died. Right? So... And this... So this is... And I essentially, look, look. Yeah, so I've, I've probably missed a bunch of explanations of... Uh, what do you call it when you fucking have to explain things? Either, either way. <laughs> um, so I've, I've defeated a few bosses. The, the only one main story boss I've defeated is Morgoth. And there's heaps of other mini, mini bosses. Um, I really wanted to showcase how I've learned, how I've progressed, uh, how I sucked for a long time. And how, look, if I can do this thing, I'm really going to put in the time. And so these fucking bosses. So it's, it's funny, right? So me personally, whenever I'm faced against an enemy for the first time, I really don't take much notice of what they're called. Because I mean, what we how are you supposed to read that? How are you supposed to say, hey, just stop for a second, Wolf God dude. Let me see your fucking name, right? Okay, let's go back to it, right? You can't really pay pay attention to it, nor what your summoners are doing. The amount of time I've seen summoners um, from watching these. Whether it's the wolves or the fucking squids or the soldiers, and I'm like, oh, cool, we did that really cool move, and 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 yeah, when I, once I got this, the mimic tier fucking summoner, like, seeing him pull off some moves that 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 I should be doing because clearly he's mimicking not what I do, but what my character is capable of, right? I think that's how it works, isn't it? So this fucking dog cave guy. My summoners is still alive. I don't know how. Weak as piss. You know, it took me ages to look, even it, to figure out the fucking uh, you could upgrade your summoners. I had no idea. So I, had, I needed so much help. But that's the, that. That is the funness of these games, or well, this game specifically, is is a, it took it. it I, I I didn't look up a lot of what you get to do on YouTube for a few months. It was really me, and my brother and I would we play it as well. Um, so anyway, so this segment here, I'm not going to talk because... because um, I was recording when I was playing, and it was a funny moment between my flatmate and I, so just have a listen. Yeah, that would have been penguins because uh, you can hear a cat meow later but so uh, yeah just just have fun watching this bit and I'll shut up for a sec and you can fucking enjoy <laughs> the scenery in the lands between
He's well known for it. Well, yeah, the thing is, he walked in here. Exactly. Right? Exactly. So... If you're going to walk in, expect to be bitten. Yeah. Right? Don't walk in someone else's house without That's permission. That's right. Yeah, exactly. You must have just given them, given them a little bit of nip. Yeah. Hey, Squid Game. Now, this ugly piece of shit, fucking diarrhea stained, egg sucking gutter trash. Look at that fucking beak. You don't want to get pecked by that. Yeah, boy. Yeah, it took me a while to figure out, okay. You, you can hit this shell of this shit, it doesn't do much, but you hit the beak, you're gonna fuck it up pretty quick. Right? <laughs> Again, I'm very shit at this. But I don't care. It's my experience. My Elden Ring story, right? Well, like, why the fuck did I summon in wolves? What's around me that can hurt me? So, these things to the right, I don't know what this thing is. With these things, with this shit appearing. Uh, is it gonna do it again? Yeah, see how there's like, to the right, there's like weird uh, celestial, not celestial, fucking spirit things. No, this guy. So, I thought this guy was, it was an NPC. I was wrong. <laughs> I'm like, oh shit, yeah, he's gonna fuck me up. And he does. Of course, he fucks me up. Because I am shit. <laughs> However, I have finished the game, <laughs> but it's it's still just because I've finished the game doesn't di dictate that I'm any good at this game. I'm not. I'm really quite bad. I have learned a lot, so I'm better. But I really am better than I was. But look at me! I've got a torch in my hand. <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> and I attack way too early. Right? I have no idea. Yeah, got him. Blood splatter. Yeah, right. Now I'm in the the crystal mine thing, and and this this amused me. That's why I started doing that capture thing. Because the the well, a it's a it's a boss, so I should have captured all the bosses. But B, he's annihilating his fucking his his spirit people. I don't know. <laughs> Squid things again. I'm going to be talking about items and. Weapons. I don't know what I can't remember what they're called. I, I don't care. <laughs> I really don't. Don't get me wrong. I love this game. It's this my second favorite game. As I said, the first is Gold Knight 007. But this is not a Gold Knight story. It's an Elden Ring story. <laughs> just to clarify, just in case you didn't didn't know what we're watching. So this blue fucking guys. So yeah, it took me a while. It took me to my mate uh, mentioned that. If you get this thing, get this guy off, your, off, off his poise, then you can start, you know, uh, damaging them, right? Inflicting damage is that word. <laughs> Who throws frisbees as a weapon, right? Apart from Gong Lao, but that's with his hat. <laughs> yeah, so I'll kill this guy, and then I'm like, all right, cool. Uh, enemy filled. Hmm, the balls of bearings. There's actually really not anything bad I can say about this game. There's nothing I really would have changed after finishing it. You know, there's nothing I would change. Oh, actually, I changed my mind. <laughs> uh, the only thing I would have the whole fucking double double form boss thing that just gave me the shit especially with Radagon it was just seemed cheap you, you spend all this time figuring out Radagon's move set and and going yeah cool I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking do that and then he turns into a big giant yellow beast using Radagon as his sword it's just a bit cheap that's really the only thing 
Unless I think of something else. So this was great. So my brother was, was like, oh, there's a dragon here. And I, and I couldn't see it. And for like 10 minutes, I was looking to the... There he is, right? And I got out my binoculars and thought, oh, where is this so-called dragon? Still couldn't see him for ages. And there he is. He's a fucking... He's, he's not a breathing rock. He's a fucking breathing, sleeping dragon. Right? It's just, and there's a dragonfly. Yeah, really, it, it literally, I was, I was there for 10 minutes going, where is this fucking thing? And I waddle off in my days, David Horsel Hoof. Whatever it is, a yak or a fucking, I don't know what that fucking, what torrent is. So, <laughs> my brother told me that there's a key behind the dragon's ass. And I should go in, sneak in. Oh, he's awake. Go and get those, that fucking key. No, not the knives. Not whatever that is. Not the greasy shit. Get the key. Yeah. So, key is in me. Because I've got to open that blue gate up in, uh, oh, not Lyurnia. Oh, some, some place. And look, look at it. Look at this guy. I'm shitting on myself again. I'm literally, for another 10 minutes, I'm trying to jump up this crystal thing to get... To, to this place to open the, the door with the key but it turns out oh, uh, <laughs> I was going the wrong way <laughs> you look at the map and I'm, I'm looking where am I looking I'm looking oh, oh I've got to get up there but no I've got to get up there <laughs> what dumb shit uh, and yeah there's a there's a, a bonfire the Side of Grace. Bonfire is demon souls and dark souls. Yeah, so I finally reached this fucking bit. Alright. And now, Volcano Manor, I believe. Or it's underneath. It's the fucking volcano area, anyways. It's like uh, I went through that place with the blue gate and I got eaten by some fuck ass and that took me to the bowels of hell, man. Crazy. I had no idea that even existed. And I tried to replicate it again, but I, I couldn't get eaten. That that bitch wouldn't wouldn't eat me again. So now I've got bats and lava, and that's the thing. In this area, there's no side of grace. So if you die, you just respawn here. You, you can technically, you know, teleport to another area. However, if I wanted to get back here and explore, I knew that I couldn't. So I thought, fuck it. I'll oh, I'll trudge my way through this volcanic shit fest of a place. And drop down, and uh, <laughs> and this guy, yeah, he wanted me for lunch, dinner, breakfast, brunch, everything. Fucked me up. And look, look what I'm holding. I'm still holding the fucking crossbow because I was shooting some bats. I am so shit at this. I'm so shit. But it it, it amuses me. He tried to grab me. He missed. Well, this guy fucked me. Yeah. Hey, side of grace. <laughs> Yay! I'm safe. <laughs> Apparently. Where's my fucking helmet? Oh, this guy's fucked me again. Okay. Bow, bow. Adding insult to injury. Yeah, I died. <laughs> Trying again. <laughs> and I could have got my runes. My lost runes, but I decided... I don't think I even thought about it. Because I'm shit. And this guy, I want to give him a piece of my mind. I missed the first swing. Yeah, I hit him. Whoa, go me. And <laughs> get grabbed. <laughs> uh, and fucking take out the dinner. Nah, I'm dead again. And fucking again. <laughs> I'm so shit. But I have fun. That's the thing. Even though I'm dying a lot, I'm still going back. You know, I want more and more and more. So, let's go. Fifth hundredth time lucky. <laughs> uh, you ain't catching me. <laughs> uh, fucked him up. Stop throwing your blue shit at me. Yay! Alright. 